it's time for benchmark hardware gaming test for the Micromax A90S Superphone Pixel as promised to you by ManiacStore.com and due to the high user comments on YouTube telling us to give us a head-to-head -head comparison with the Micromax A110 we have both the devices ready in front of you the Micromax A110 Canvas 2 and the Micromax A90S Pixel First of all, we are going to show you both the handsets from the front and back side so that you can compare the size, the look and feel of the handsets. We have all the applications ready for the benchmarking tests and will be shown to you very soon. So now let me power on the devices quickly. They are already powered on and ready to go. I unlock this screen and we have both the handsets, both the displays ready in front of you. So I'm going to quickly run the quadrant standard test on both the devices for you. First let us go to the system information and check the details. Here it is showing SDK 4.0.4 and the model is A90S product Micro Max and as we go below it has uh, ARM V7 processor revision O version 7L and it, it is clocked at 1000 megahertz. It has two cores and architecture 7. The memory in the A90S is showing 482948 kilobytes so that makes it uh, 482 MB. Yes we can call it a 512 MB RAM phone and while on the A110 the SDK is 4.0.4 and the model A110 product is S9081 uh, maybe some code by the manufacturer I suppose uh, the CPU is ARM V7 processor revision O version 7L so yes both the devices have the same processor here both the devices are clocked at 1000 megahertz and both the devices have two cores and architecture 7 now let us run the full benchmark test for you Oh, sorry, I forgot to show you the display and the sensors here. Right, so the, in the A90S, the display resolution is 418 to 728 pixels and DPI 240 240, while in the A110, it is 480 into 854 DPI 240 240. A110 has a refresh rate of 29.84 uh, hertz and the A90S has the refresh rate of 65.69 hertz so we can clearly see the difference between the refresh rate here the A90S has almost double the refresh rate of what the A110 has now the extensions are ok now let me go to sensors on both the devices yes we can see here that the A90S comes with a Yamaha 530 orientation sensor a Yamaha 533 axis magnetic field sensor, a 3 axis accelerometer, proximity sensor and a light sensor. While the A110 has orientation sensor, 3 axis accelerometer and a proximity sensor. All done. Now let's go and run the full benchmark on both the handsets at the same time. Yes guys, so we have the final results of the quadrant test here. The A90 shows a total score of 2739 and uh, the A110 shows a total score of 2371. As usual, the HTC One X is on the top and Micromax is nowhere in the top lists of the smartphones here. So I'll give you the individual figures. So let me zoom in so that you can have a look at the individual figures. A90S has a CPU 4491 count and the A110 has a CPU 4229 count. The memory on A90S is 2902 count and the memory on A110 is 2697 count. The input output of A90S is 3773 and the input output of the A110 is 3325. 
2D score 505 for the A90S and 2D score 357 for the A110. 3D score for the A90S 2024 and 3D score for the A110 1249. Guys, this clearly shows that A90S is a much much superior phone than the A110. I would personally like to recommend you that if you don't go by the size or the little price difference by Micromax, I personally can tell you that A90S is a much 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 better phone than the A110 in terms of touch in terms of the uh, interface in terms of the feel i get while holding both the handsets i have personally used both the handsets and i would recommend anybody buying a a90s over and above the a100 or the a110 so now let us quit the applications and start the other test let me quit the applications here yes here we go and i'm quitting the applications here also okay so now let me start the nina mark 2 test on both the handsets parallel okay so now we are running the test on both the devices parallel guys so we have the scores here I can publish the scores for you and here we have the results yes guys so the Micromax A110 has a 25.4 FPS score and the A90S has a 23.6 FPS score uh, we can say that both these scores are almost equivalent, but they're not so good. But yeah, for a device priced at this range, this, this should be enough. Okay, guys. So now let us quit this application and run for you a full N22 benchmark test. Okay, guys. So I run the N22 benchmark on both the handsets for you at the same time. As you can see that the A110 and the A90S both are unauthenticated devices. Well, now just ignore that and let's start the test. Okay guys, so we have the scores for the N22 benchmark. The total score for A110 is 4932 and the total score for A90S is 5418. As I told you guys, A90S is definitely a better device than the A100 and the A110. You can clearly see the N22 score given here. N22 gives A110 3 out of 5 stars and gives 3.5 to A90S. The CPU, GPU, RAM and input output of both the devices can easily be seen by you guys. So let us quit this application and I can show you the multi-touch also. We will now test the multi-touch for both the devices for you. So here we have the multi-touch tester. The A110 uh, company claimed was a 5 touch uh, register. But let us do it for you so that we come to know. Yes, it registers a 4. It registers a 4. Finally, it gave me a score of 5. Yeah, it does not cross 5. That's true. Let us see here. A90S is not crossing 3. So guys, this is the multi-touch test done on the A90S and the A110 for you. Now guys, let us quit everything and quickly show you the browser test and the video test for both the devices. Here we go, I quit the multi-touch. And yes, we open the browser and load our own favorite site, maniacstore.com for you.
Okay, so I'll press maniacstore.com on both the devices at the same time and let's see the browsing speed here. Guys, in the entire video, I have noticed one thing that both the handsets are connected to the same Wi-Fi network in our office, but the A90S is showing us more Wi-Fi bars than the A110. Now, I don't know whether this particular handset which I have in my hand has some Wi-Fi issues or it really has a low Wi-Fi connectivity. But the A90S is clearly showing us that the uh, browser speed, the internet speed and the average time for loading a website is also faster than the A110. And I'm very sure that uh, the A90S in all terms is a superior device than the A110. So here we have the internal links also. We can check the speed again. Again, the A90S has proved itself and has loaded the page much faster than what the A110 does. Okay, so let me quit this and we will open a video on both the devices for you. Let us play the YouTube standard video for you. Okay guys, so this was all for today and thank you for watching the benchmark and the hardware test for the A90S and the A110. We also showed you the browser and internet connectivity speed head to head of both the devices and also the video quality of both the devices on YouTube. So guys, we will be back with the gaming review of both the devices very soon on YouTube again. And yes, you can log on to maniacstore.com to buy your favorite devices. The Micromax A100, the Micromax A110 and the Micromax A90S which are ready available with maniacstore.com and ships in 24 to 48 hours. Thank you guys. Thank you.